Russia's Hunter B stealth drone will make its test flight in August 2019 or soon, Russian news agency TASS reported. Hunter B's much anticipated first flight could signal the beginning of a long development that could end with the Russian Air Force operating fighter style stealth drones. A flying wing similar in shape to the U.S. Air Force's B 2 stealth bomber, Hunter B could penetrate enemy defenses to deliver ordnance. The subsonic Hunter B is in the same class as China's Tanying drone. The U.S. Air Force's RQ-170 surveillance unmanned aerial vehicle, the U.S. Navy's experimental X-47 BUAV and Boeing's X-45C drone demonstrator. It's unclear how many Hunter B prototypes exist. At least one was on the flight line when Russian President Vladimir Putin on May 14, 2019 visited the Kklov State Flight Test Center in Russia's Astrakhan region. Commercial satellite imagery confirmed the Hunter B drone's presence at Kklov alongside various other warplane types, including the Yak-130 trainer and several versions of the Su-30 multi-role fighter. It was the unmanned aerial vehicle's first appearance since Jan 2019, when photos began circulating depicting the large, flying wing UAV on the ground at an airfield in Novosibirsk. One questioned whether Hunter B is very stealthy. The most glaring issue is the crude engine installation, which also does not seem to include any provisions for a stealthier arrangement in the future, Trevithick wrote. The exhausts are a notoriously complex component of any stealth flying wing aircraft. The entire engine arrangement, including both the inlet and exhaust, also appears to be relatively in line. Another feature that would hurt the aircraft's low observable characteristics. The satellite imagery indicates Hunter B has a wingspan of around 50 feet, making it roughly the same size as the X 47B or an Su 30 manned fighter. Size confers volume and hints that Hunter B, whatever its stealth qualities, might possess a large fuel load and a correspondingly long range. At this point, it is going to be heaviest and fastest UAV in Russian service if and when fielded, but additional testing and evaluation will have to take place in order for this unmanned system to be fully functional, Bendit said. Its speed up to 620 miles per hour and weight, up to 20 tons means that a host of aerodynamic, electronic and high-tech issues need to be worked out. The Russian military is running multiple UAV-related projects, Cooper added. Thus the emergence of this project is perfectly normal. Russian crews are already getting ready, the first generation of pilots and ground crews for UFs just completed their four years long training, and they meanwhile have plenty of experience in operating UAV in Syria, Cooper said. All the above means that Hunter B might need few more years of development before it's ready for squadron service. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.